what's going on guys welcome back to another video today we will be doing an oil change and a transmission oil change on a 2020 honda civic 1.5 liter so right now i'm just showing that you got to take the oil cap off and you also have to take the dipstick off when you're draining the oil it'll help the oil drain out better so that you don't have the liquid without air going you know what i mean so it'll just help the liquid flow better i've already got the car jacked up and we'll hit the bottom okay now that the car is all jacked up we're underneath the car there's the oil drain plug you can see it right there at the back of the oil pan and we use a 17 millimeter socket on it and as you can see it doesn't take much force and boom it's released and then here is the oil uh filter and it's just a spin-off you turn it counterclockwise i usually drain the oil out fully before i take this off okay so here's our oil drain plug i've already taken off the crush washer i'm going to replace it with a new crush washer that i got from honda uh, i think it was like 67 cents canadian and here's the oil filter i got it from ams oil i'll be doing an ams oil oil change um everything ams oil love the oil and what i'm doing here is basically i'm showing you that before i did i put this on the car i get the gasket and put a whole bunch of oil on it and i also pre-fill the filter so that's what we're about to do okay so my car is a little bit different i have a oil catch can on the car I'm just gonna take this off uh, and empty out the oil. Probably won't be much, but that's that. Okay, so here we are. And this is going to be the oil that I am using. I'm using OW20 AMS oil, 100% synthetic. And we will be adding 3.7 liters, technically 3.2 because I already put some in the filter. But uh, I love this oil, really recommend it. And yeah, I'm just gonna fill these in and we'll get to the transmission oil change. Okay, this is looking at the transmission. That is the drain plug right there. What we do is we put the end of the ratchet right in there and we loosen it up okay now that we have the transmission drain plug out basically what i'm going to be showing you is it's a magnetic drain plug so you see all that guck on there that's metal shavings from the transmission so i just get a paper towel i clean it off i'm using an older one but it'll do the trick just clean it with the paper towel make sure all of these shavings are off of it and we're good to go afterwards there's also a crush washer on this i got it from honda you can see it there uh for five dollars and 57 cents canadian okay so for the transmission oil change i drained out all the fluid i put it into my oil pan and then i measured everything out so my car i drained out three point nine liters of oil and i did that by dumping the oil from the oil pan to a measuring cup and then i would put it the remainder of the old oil in the bottles etc so forth to get the exact amount that i would need to replace okay now that all of the oils are done um i'm gonna go take it out for a test drive the oil change has been done to the exact fill level and I filled up the transmission from there. Fill level, all done. Hope you like the video. Give it a thumbs up. 
don't forget to subscribe for more content. I think the next video we'll be doing is the downpipe. Bye-bye.